Jungle Explorer here and today I'm going to be doing something a little unusual. I'm going to be reviewing this Comfier Cyclone New Generation Cyclonic Vacuum. This is a cordless vacuum. Um, this was sent to me by a company that just uh, contacted me asking me if I'd look at their vacuum for them. And I don't normally do vacuum cleaners. Um, but uh, I, I asked my wife, I said, would you be interested in a cordless vacuum? And she said, yeah. So I said, well, okay, I'll take a look at it for you. So they sent it to me. And uh, I'm just going to look at what it's got here. It says on the box. It's got uh, some uh, different connections here. It's, like I said, it's, it's a cordless. Um, has some stuff. Let's break right into the box. It's got a nice box on it here. Get this tape open. See what's going on inside. Get my trusty Gerber multi-tool out here. Never really done a vacuum cleaner um, review before, but uh, I have done a lot of vacuum in my life. Uh, I share the house chores equally. Um, sometimes it's one thing my wife doesn't like to do is, is vacuum. So maybe she'll like this thing. So wow, that looks pretty good. Let's see here. We've got a, uh, this is a wall charger. I'm assuming it screws on to the wall like so and you hang this thing up, but let's get the rest of it out. Got a little uh, dust uh, vacuum thing here. That, that looks pretty cool. Okay. See here, this is a little corner deal. It has also a brush on it. Let's see here. I think you have to push this button down. There we go. Huh. So it's convertible and retractable. Cool. All right. This is the um, main tube. The battery. The floor thing here. Let's see. pivots and swivels like that it's got a little brush real soft brush nothing got a whole lot of grit to that brush it's real real baby baby soft there so it's made for more finer things let's see what this is um not sure okay let's pull this out this is the main thing here i bet this thing's pretty easy to put together i bet it just snaps right together let's see uh, there's two holes here. There's two holes there. I bet that goes in there. Push that button down right there. And snap it together. Okay. And let's see here. Um, let's see this. Where's the rest of it go together here? Well, this actually goes in here. Okay, I see. This is for this. So that that's your head thing here. Like that. Looks good. Looks good. Um, let me pull that out there. That's cool. I bet you take that out like that. There we go. All right, so just had to figure that out. Okay, so you push that button, that goes in there. And, okay, that goes on there like that. So you got a little hand, cool little hand vacuum there. Still try, trying to figure out how this thing works. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. Oh, I see. This goes right in here directly. Cool. So you got that right there. Um, well, let me uh, charge this battery up. Let's see here. Oh, I guess the battery's got to go inside here. All right. So that goes in there like that. And then you hook this like that so I guess it would 
mount on the wall somewhere like that right there. Hmm. Pretty interesting. I'll have to figure out a way to mount it. But I'm not going to mount it right now. What I'm going to go do is charge this battery up and then come back and we'll do some work with it. Okay, so I got the battery charged up here and uh, got the, did a little playing around with this thing to kind of figure out how it works um, while I was charging it. Uh, a little rough to get this thing out here. Well, you know what? I'm just going to leave it in. Um, so again, the battery goes right here in the back. Use these two buttons on either side here to release it. All right, and uh, what I've got here, let's go ahead and turn it on. And it has speed control. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is plug this thing right into the end of this here. All right, and just for example, I got some marbles here. Okay, this is on low. Go to high. Really got some suction power there. Okay. Now I'm going to go ahead and take this off. So we got a bigger throat here. Turn on high and. Well. Can't quite get them up that far. Well. And they will go in. It'll pick up big stuff. Can't quite suck it up all the way. Can't quite suck it up all the way in that big tube. It'll do it on the when it's uh, down low like this. But uh, it has a hard time getting them marbles. Of course, a marble is a pretty big thing. Now, the way you get these things out, I can dump them out like that or. This thing comes off, dump them out. I'm just using the marbles example. I'm gonna, my old pickup truck's in pretty bad shape. It needs some cleaning, so I'm gonna go out and vacuum it later. But let me show you how this little uh, filter works. There's three ways to uh, get stuff out of here. The marbles are a little big for it, so they won't kind of get past the little filter here. They, they get stuck, stuck up in there, but uh, Big stuff comes in through here, goes in through this little side pocket there, and it falls down in this bucket. It's got a HEPA filter right here that uh, filters the air going out. And then it has a, a net filter, or kind of a, a strainer right here to keep the bigger stuff out of the HEPA filter. So all of it's removable. Pretty neat little system. Um, click that there. You can dump that out like that, latch that in there, uh, and then it kind of tilts up in here like so, locks in, you're ready to go. That's pretty cool. Um, let me try it right here. It's really powerful. So it didn't have no trouble picking them things up and getting them up in there. I think I did a little too fast and they got jammed up in there. I bet you this, I think two of them, well maybe they all did get in there. Let's pull that off there, pull this out here, there we go. So it's got some power, um, 
for that kind of stuff. There we go. Um, you can use the attachments at the end of the pole, the, the long wand here, what do you want to call that tube? Or you can put them right in here for extra power, right up close. Let's see how that works there. I had it working earlier. There we go. Lock that up there. Does good. So it's got some pretty cool stuff. Uh, I'm gonna do a little uh, floor vacuuming here. It's pretty dirty here in my office. Or this is kind of a, a old workshop out here that I've got. So let me um, put this back on, and we'll do a little vacuuming out here because I probably won't be using this part of it in my truck that much. So let's see here. Okay, so I've spread some dirt and sand, little rocks out there so we can see what it does, just to give it a good try. I'm gonna go ahead and put it up on high. Looks like it done a pretty good job. See how close it gets up in here, these edges. <laughs> About a half a pound of dust and rocks there. So, turn it off and let's see what we got in the bucket here. Set that down. There we go. Dust, rocks, little rocks, leaves. Filter worked good. Look at our hip pepper filter here. Did its job. So, well, now I'm gonna take it out and vacuum my truck and catch a little footage of that. And uh, then we'll come back and, and finish this video up. So here I am outside with my Silverado 2500 HD and I'm gonna get ready to vacuum it out here. It's a dirty job, but somebody's gotta do it. And uh, got the, let me get the vacuum cleaner and I'll get at it. Okay, this is my side and obviously it's the dirtiest, so I'm gonna try it with the little uh, floor thing attached. Let's see how it works. I don't think it's really going to do much. Let's hit the high power. It's kind of sweeping a little bit. There's a lot of mud in there that's stuck on. Let's go ahead and flip this off. And let's put a, let's put this little sucker on right here. I bet that'll do a whole lot better. getting the nooks and crannies with this thing right here.
<laughs> I forgot where that thing was. Throw that up on the seat there. I'm not supposed to be there. There you have it, the Comfier Cyclone. Um, 22.2 volt lithium ion cordless vacuum cleaner. Um, it does really good. Um, just uh, I really like the design of it, the way the, the little the cup is here. I vacuumed my truck out with it. It's got a bunch of stuff in it there. That's, poof, that's what I got out of my truck. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff there. Grass, things like that. Um, you know, this little thing right here is pretty cool. It twists like that. So you can really make some really tight corners with it. That's, that's really cool how that works. You know what? I just made a mess right here on my, my video table. Well, you know what? Good thing I have a Comfier vacuum cleaner to clean it up with. Ooh. baby that's what I'm talking about clean that right off did you see that just brought it took that dirt in no problem problem is it's sucking the darn cloth up so hard the comfier it's a weird name Ooh, let's go this way that's cool man that is just that is just so cool there all right. Well, let's see. With, the, with all the testing that I did with it um, and the vacuuming of my truck, as you saw. Of course, I just showed you little clips there. I didn't show you the whole thing. Of course, you know, you, in my truck, there was a lot of caked on mud. It's, nothing's going to get that off. I'm going to have to wash that off or something like that. But it, you saw the dirt it picked up out of it. But uh, see right here shows that it's down one third of the battery power. So the battery definitely uh, lasted long enough for me to do my little testing and uh, to vacuum out my truck. Plus, you know, I do, I do, there's a lot of stuff I'm doing off camera that you're not seeing. And uh, because, you know, I've never used it before, so I'm trying the thing out. Um, I think it's done pretty good. I like the system. It took me a little bit to figure it out at first. Um, but once I figured it out, you know, it works real good. Uh, it has a little seal right there. It kind of makes it hard to get knob, but that keeps the air, uh, you know, that keeps the air from going around it. So very portable. You could just charge it like that, or you could hook it up. Um, now I got to find a neat, cool place to hook this thing up to the wall somewhere, where it'll just uh, stay charged. And evidently, uh, it's intended to be left on the charger, so when you need it, uh, it works. Hmm, really cool, you know, comes with plenty of good stuff. Comes with this little uh, cool brush here, this adaptable cool brush. Uh, I'm just going to call it the Comfier Cyclone because that's what, uh, what it says on the box. Okay, so you saw how that all worked. I took, put it all together for you, snapped it. I've tried everything I can with it, showed you how it worked, picked up marbles, things like that. It does a really good job, so... Um, I'm going to recommend it. It's uh, pretty nice, you know. Uh, as with all my videos, I try to just not tell you what to do with them, but just put them through the test to see how they work, 
and this one uh, actually turns out to be a really nice unit really like it so I have hoped you've enjoyed this video as much as I've enjoyed using this little vacuum cleaner if you have please like um, subscribe and when you subscribe don't forget to click the little bell why YouTube wants you to subscribe and click that little bell I'm not sure but that's how they do it so click that little yellow bell over there in the bottom right hand corner underneath the video and that way you'll get notifications when I up upload new videos. So anyways, until next time, this is the Jungle Explorer, signing out.